beautiful Saturday afternoon at Bluebell Park for a big series finale between third ranked LSU and Texas A&M. It is the rubber game of a three game set. Let's see if that can improve as that's a base hit from the nine hole hitter Andrew Stevenson. So LSU now with two on and nobody out. I think everybody in the park thought that Stevenson was going to butt right there. McMullen slapper to center field. That ball is down in front of Craig Bratson. Ross going to stop at third, probably wisely so, but the bases are loaded and nobody out for the number three team in the country. And this is where it matters that it's a seven inning game, not a nine. Over at second, they got him picked off. The 1 0 Laird sends it into right field. Base hit. In to score comes Ross, and LSU strikes first, 1 0 in the third to drop the draft it's the only reason he got to LSU well, Bragman on a 3-0 swings and he finds himself into a double play the 3-0 green light to one of the best hitters in the country ultimately cost the Tigers Kyle two out of the fourth he's thrown just 33 cents and that's a slow roll to Bregman Bregman cannot make the barehanded play and that's Daniel Mingdon on base he's going to go for second and he'll dive in safely Heads up base running play by Mingdon. Bratson up the middle. That's a base hit. Mingdon coming home. The throw cut off. It's 1 1. I would tend to agree with you, and that is trouble for the Aggies. Ty Ross into the gap, being waved into second. Here comes the throw from Bratson. Not in time. Lead off double for the Tigers. Stevenson there gets it down perfectly bunted Jester with a tough play nobody on the bag Langford was off the bag two on and nobody out hit to right stayed him back if he makes the catch it'll get a run home anyway Foster tags it third LSU with a 2-1 lead Melton Check swing, short, Bregman, flip to second, and that'll do it. LSU comes into College Station and takes two of three from the Aggies and in the process wraps up their 17th SEC Western Division Championship.